Hey guys, welcome back to another nail video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how I created these press-on nails using some beautiful shades sent over to me from Madame Glam. So if you guys are interested, continue to watch. So here is my setup, you guys. I have all the polishes out, all the tools I'm going to be using. This is just a quick look at the colors that they sent over. So if you see any colors that you like, I'm also going to show you the names and you can find the link in my description bar below. For my nails, I'm actually going to use three colors, which will be these two. And they're named Your Joke and Rockin' It. And then I'm also going to use Rockin' Blue. So this is the design that we are going for and that I'm going to show you all. So first, I'm going to start off with Madame Glam's Base Coat. And all of these polishes are gel polishes, so I do have my um, UV light over here to the side to cure my nails. So make sure that none of the polish moves or transfers. And I usually just sit it in there for 60 seconds or 99. So my base coat is going to be this beautiful pale green shade. I really like this color even when I saw it like on its own. I was like dang I really should just leave the nails solid because this color is really really pretty. It definitely gives spring but even though it's not spring I would still for sure wear this color during the fall. So now we're going to get a little bit more into detail with the designs that I am doing and um, the tools that you see me using, all of this stuff comes from Amazon. So that's how I was able to create this French nail tip look. So I'm taking that blue polish and I'm just creating like a tip on top of the green. Once that is complete, of course, I'm going to put that back under the UV light just to make sure that it is dry. And that's the final look. And on the other nails, I kind of did the same thing. I gave it a tip, but I also used some of that glitter polish and I just kind of lined it underneath the blue, just giving the nail a little razzle dazzle. <laughs> and then I'm going to do the thumbnail with like a, a half green, half blue type of look. Most of these nail designs were inspired from pictures I saw on Pinterest and I was just kind of going with it and just seeing what... I could achieve at home. For that nail, I kind of just gave it like a little lines and squiggles, you know, just to make each nail different, but still have the same color palette. So once we get finished with all the designs, I'm then going to use Madame Glam's Top Coat Polish. And this is after I put those nails under the UV light to let those polishes dry. And then we're going to put it back in the UV light um, for another 99 seconds just to finalize the nails. So once the nails are dry, I am then going to grab my nail file and just file around the ends to make the nails look very sharp and clean. And that definitely takes some time, dedication, focus. <laughs> and now we're going to move on to prepping my nails. 
I have this nail file, which again is from Amazon. Link in the description bar. I'm just removing the excess oils. I also had older glue on my nails and that was helping get that old glue off of my nails. And then I'm gonna use my cuticle trimmer just to kind of clean up my cuticles a little bit. Once that's finished, now we're going to move on to gluing the nails on. And you guys know I love press-ons, so yes, I did create these via press-on. And I'm just going to use some nail glue that I had lying around. But I do have a specific glue I do like to use. Also, purchased from Amazon. That link is in my description bar. Um, anytime I have glue like kind of running over, I'll just wipe it onto the next nail. But... Um, usually I just hold that nail on for maybe about 10-15 seconds just to make sure it's nice and secure and it's had a few moments to kind of dry and grip onto my nail. So once we get that last pinky nail on, you guys, then I'm going to take some cuticle oil, um, just put it around my nails just to freshen them up a bit. And that is it. That is how I created these extra long coffin press on nails. So if you guys are interested in any other products I use, everything is in my description bar below. If you guys are interested in these polishes, make sure you check out Madam Glam. They, of course, do have they do have other colors that you guys can try out. Um, a bunch of colors actually they have a great selection so make sure you check out their website i hope you guys found this video useful i thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you all in my next one bye y'all